everybody it's been so long since I have done a video like this um, we finally moved into our new house um, and um, I just set up this new little planning session with my cute little plants I have a plant obsession if you don't know I will have a blog about that soon um, with all my plants but anyways back to this video this is going to be a Hobby Lobby um, haul video and I went and saw some pretty amazing sales so I wanted to just come and show you some things that I purchased at Hobby Lobby recently um, so first thing I am getting a new Foxy Fix B6 size so I have been on the lookout for little notebooks that are the five by seven sizes um, just for refills, for notes and things. Um, and I saw this one at Hobby Lobby and it's a three piece notebook set and it comes with three notebooks. I have been obsessed with these sort of tropical leaf prints lately, um, especially with like washi tapes and um, just any kits with these kind of leaves. So I wanted to pick these up. These are just um, wide rolled notebooks. So I plan on using these just for like brain dumps and just, you know, quick lists, things like that, um, that I don't want to, that I need more space for really. Um, maybe notes for work, things like that. So I love this first one. This one has dreams with some gold foil on the front, which is absolutely gorgeous with these palm leaves. Um, and then this one is more of a um, more illustrated looking with the um, large tropical leaf. And then there's the banana leaves. So this is one of my favorite leaves lately. Um, so those are gorgeous. I love those. And all three of them are just these wide rolled. Um, so I can't wait to use those um, as soon as my Foxy Fix comes in. Next thing that I found was um, that they had a lot of Paper Studio products on 50% off. So I was pretty excited to find a bunch of these things. This is the first thing that I found and it is by the Paper Studio, their Agenda 52 line. And it is Everyday Borders Foiled Sticker Pack 348 piece. And this has things like um, cute little foiled, um, almost like full boxes. I'm not sure. I wonder if these are going to fit, um, maybe in that Erin Condren size boxes. I'm not sure. Um, but they had some really cool little pieces of washi, um, and just pages and pages of washi, a couple of quote stickers, more washi, more washi quote stickers. And then it just, I believe it just repeats itself. Does it? Oh no, it doesn't, they're all different. Okay, cool. Yeah, so there's a bunch of different washi um, and little quote stickers, different boxes. I absolutely love just having little things like this because I can use them not only in my planner but also um, in my uh, Project Life album because I just think these uh, add some cute little extra embellishment um, so that's it. Cool. I love these. I loved the foil on these. Um, I just thought they were so beautiful. Um, let's see if they fit in the Erin Condren box. Okay, so I have an Erin Condren here. Let me say if these fit. Oh, wow. Perfectly. Okay, so they fit perfectly in the Erin Condren size boxes. Um, so that's convenient. They're not the full length though, obviously. They're a little bit shorter, um, but that's okay. I usually don't use full boxes in the sense that people normally use full boxes. So that'll be fun to use. Um, next up, just one thing really quick before I show the rest of the Paper Studio stuff that I found, um, is just some crafters tape. I run through this stuff like crazy, so I just went ahead and got just um, just kind of like there's almost like a store brand or something like that. Um, just a real quick, quick, um, cheap version instead of getting the Tombos because I just run through this stuff 
all the time. So this was a little four pack um, of that crafter's tape and yeah, just something I needed. Next up, something that I've been wanting to try doing is making my own um, traveler's notebook bookmarks. So I got a few charms that I plan on making my traveler's notebook no, um, bookmarks with. So I got an L for Lindsay. Um, it's kind of, and it's a little bit, kind of like a gold color, which I plan on pairing with, she believed she could, so she did. And it has a little star with a little gemstone on it. Um, so I plan on pairing those two together. Next up, I got these cute little um, fruit charms. They have two pineapples, two strawberries, and two watermelons. I plan on just pairing each of them up with each other. Um, I thought those were pretty cute. So, yeah. So I got those, um, and to go with those, I got just some jump rings, some little lobster clasps with an eyelet, and then these little cord crimps, and then I plan on using those with this leather cord. It's round leather cord in beige, which I think just goes with everything. So I plan on using those with that. Then I found more Paper Studio sales um, with some charms that I thought were super cute. Um, first up are these little leather tassels in turquoise. Um, they have pink, gray, and then kind of like a, a neutral beige, which I thought would be super cute. I wanna pair these pink ones maybe with the pineapples possibly and then these the gray ones i think with these two probably just one each because i think two would be too much i don't know we'll see we'll see what it what it looks like when i start pairing them together so i got those and then these last things you're gonna die it's so cute they are these little llama charms they had a bunch of different versions of charms and things like this, these little enamel charms. Um, and I just thought these were adorable. It says, yes, and then there's a cute little cacti, cactus, and then a llama with a little beret and some glasses, um, a little yellow llama with some heart eyes, and then a pink pineapple. And I thought those were freaking adorable. Um, I probably plan on pairing these two together maybe and then maybe this this llama and this charm and then i don't know what i'm going to use him for maybe i'll pair him with i don't know maybe a pineapple i don't know i don't i'm not sure how i'm going to pair it up but i got those because i wanted to um make some really cute bookmarks for my traveler's notebook that i still can't wait to get here can you tell <laughs> So yeah, I am excited for those. Um, but yeah, and also possibly researching, um, creating these and creating just some unique combinations uh, for the shop possibly. So if you're interested in more um, charms and things, like bookmarks and things for your Erin Condren or your uh, Traveler's Notebook, I'm considering doing those. Um, I just think these are so cute. So I'm gonna try these out. Last but not least, I found a bunch of washi tape. And again, the Paper Studio stuff was all 50% off. Um, so I picked up a lot of washi tape. The first up is the just simple one. I don't have, I use the skinny washi a lot on my monthly spreads and I didn't have a very big variety. So I was pretty excited that these were 50% off. Um, so I got this full set of decorative tape, um, washi tape that is in the full spectrum of colors so I could use them. And probably I, I wanted to be able to make my spreads a little bit more color coordinated in the monthlies. Um, so I was excited to find this and I don't know if I want to keep them in here or I might try and find some way to organize them. I am running out of space in my um, washi 
drawer so I'm gonna have to figure out how I'm gonna store all these but anyways I was so excited to find these I use these on the monthly spread to um, span across several days this next set of washi is from that the paper studio and their agenda 52 line and this is the make it happen collection um, I thought this was I mean banana leaves they sold me right there so let me zoom you in a little bit So the washi in this collection I thought was just absolutely beautiful. Um, there is a, I think it's like a brick almost, like a teal brick. Oop, I'm tearing it. So yeah, I think it's like a, a teal brick, um, kind of medium washi, not full length but not too skinny. Um, so there's that one. There's a couple more of these skinny washies. There's a pink and white stripe one. Focus. Pink and white stripe one. There's kind of this corally pink. Um, this striped, um, diagonally striped one is kind of almost like an ombre rainbow with pink and um, blue and yellow and stuff like that. Then a green washi, which I wonder, I think there's another washi that's the same color as that one, so I might give that away um, to my mom or something. And then there's a black and white hearts, and then this one is kind of like a watercolor splash skinny washi. So there's those. Then there's the thicker washi. This is another medium one. It has, let me see if it'll focus. There you go. Okay, so it has this kind of geometric pattern and it's kind of like a beigey pink um, with gold geometric pattern accents on there. Um, and then the reason for the name, it is this Make It Happen washi with a gold accent at the top so and that looks pretty cool with the little um, different colors going on so there's that one I don't know how how I'll use this one maybe um, in project life I'm not sure um, this one is pretty cute. This one says Hello Weekend on it over and over again with this marble background. And I thought this would be just really cute, especially for Project Life or in spreads. Um, I think it would go pretty well. Um, probably would not fit both going from end to end in the Erin Condren. Um, probably puts a little bit of washi on it, but it's still pretty cute. Next up is, of course, the one that sold me. All right, next up is the one that sold me, and it is this banana leaf washi and I just think it's gorgeous. Um, I've just been obsessed with this and I plan on decorating my new Foxy Fix with a lot of tropicals and fruits so I think this will go great when I am setting up my new Foxy Fix. And then after that I got also it's this conquer with these cute little eyelashes and the word conquer is in um, a gold foil and then lastly it's these cute flowers on a black background pretty cute so that was in that set and the grand prize was this full box set of just really cute washi um, this is the trendy set and I just thought these had just a lot of really super cute designs on them um, that I plan on using a lot in my new planner setup. All right, I don't think I'll take out all of them, um, but I just thought 
these, I mean, this is complete set. Like if you're starting out and you don't have a big washi collection, go to Hobby Lobby and they have these box sets. Um, I loved, the thing that I loved the most was a lot of these plant inspired ones. Um, I especially loved those with the little fern leaves and these little um, decorative ones. Oh, look at the tropical leaves with the pink background. Isn't that gorgeous? Okay, I love these so much. Oh my goodness, the cutest little cacti um, in different shades of green. Um, I thought these kind of looked like Simply Gilded and I am not that person that has ever been able to order things fast enough. <laughs> so if you are one of those people like me, um, they have a couple similar looking ones at Hobby Lobby. Um, I just loved the cute cactus ones. Um, this one says memories with gold foil and pink, some gold foil leaves, some um, crosses, just absolutely gorgeous. Little pink um, washi with some gold pineapples. Oh my goodness, look at the cute flamingos and the pineapples. I love this. Oh my goodness. That's cute. Versatile for a lot of spreads. Um, little hashtags, that's cute. This one says, oh hello, over and over again. That's cute. With a little watercolor background. That's cute. Little donuts, love. Sprinkles, um, little flag banners. And then what are these? These are like, Little coffee cups with a pink background. That's cute. Um, this says notes, notes, notes over and over again. Little ampersands, um, some gold diagonal washi tape, more diagonal washi tape. This is cute. This would be cute for um, just a little extra something. Um, this is, this just says ideas over and over again in gold foil. Um, just simple geometric design. I think these look like almost like feathers. Almost. Um, this one, I don't love the colors, but just I could see using that in a couple spreads. Some stripes. This floral is so pretty. Love it. Um, simple peach stripes with gold um, accents. Cute. And then another little flora one with gold. Lots of gold in this set. So absolutely love this. I can't wait to use these. And that is everything that I got from Hobby Lobby. If you like this video and want to see more hauls, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below for more videos. And I will see you next time. Bye.